He's got a long road ahead of him to get the Lakers back to respectability. The Charlotte Hornets trying to get there themselves hadn't been to the second round of the playoffs since 2002. Here's Dwayne Wade on his team in this postseason. I've never been in the foxhole with these with this group in this situation. So this is the first time for all of us together. I don't want nobody to think about the moment. Well, you know what? The moment was a heat loss, and their season was over. And look at Wade come up with the block. Nicholas Batum scores, but with the block, Wade ties Michael Jordan for the most in playoff history by a guard. Wade, as Ringo once said, getting by with a little help from his friends. Isn't that Joe Cocker? It, well, it, he did it too. But it was the Beatles first. Sorry. The song, I don't, and Ringo didn't write it, I'm sure, as was the case with a lot of Beatles songs. But I digress. Hassan Whiteside, eight points, four blocks in the first half. Fourth quarter, Kemba Walker comes alive. Walker exploded for 37 points in this game. 14 of 30 from the field, single-handedly getting Charlotte back into the game. But just over three minutes to go. Heat leading by six. Here's Dwayne Wade making a three for the first time in 56 games. Heat led by nine, under a minute to go. Just a two-point game until Wade does that. And then 25 seconds to go again, a one-possession game. Wade with Courtney Lee all over him like a cheap suit. Just an impossible shot. It's like the bad guy from, uh, what was the old movie, the uh, Daniel son and Karate Kid? Karate Kid, yeah, thanks. Anyway, it's getting late. Emma Walker blocked at the rim by Wade, who had 26 points. Sweep the leg, Johnny. Six rebounds, four assists, three blocks. They heat. Force a game seven. They win it 97-90. Miami comes through in a must-win situation. They should be used to it. Their third straight win when they've trailed 3-2 in a series. Previous two times came in the 2013 NBA Finals against the Spurs and the 2012 Conference Finals against the Celtics. That brings us to Game 7 in Miami. The Heat 5-3 and three all time in Game 7s, including winning the last three. The Hornets, on the other hand, 0-1. They haven't been to the conference semis since 2002.